Good day, class. My name is Professor Adventure, and welcome back to what I think is going to be our last episode of Magic School of Us Explores the Solar System. I've kind of been doing all of these one in a row because I realized I don't think you can save in this one. I don't think saving is an option in this Magic School of Us game. So instead of waiting until, you know, later on to do it, I figured, you know, I've got time. Let's just finish this. Let's do it tonight. That's why the shirt hasn't changed too much. Also, I don't know if you noticed, shirt has changed. We're going to be moving in a little bit of a different direction. So, when we left off, we had, we're at Saturn, which I think is where Miss Frizzle is. So we are going to move on to Uranus, which we have already been at, haven't we? Yeah, we have. Go in there anyway! Because who knows, maybe it's got like great music in their, uh, in, uh, the game, the mini game that we're going to play, which I'm, I'm, I'm dead serious. Those songs are going to be on my phone. I don't know how I'm going to get them, but I'm going to do it. Ooh. Those are a lot of cool space sounds. Oh, I almost crashed in the mountain. Yes, we've definitely been here before. Alright, just leaving the bus. Carlos, let's hear a joke, buddy. Summer on Uranus can last 21 years. Just think, if you were born at the beginning of summer, you'd never have to go to school. We heard that joke already. Endless summer. Ah ha 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 ho ho. This is the tilt and match science experiment. Ooh. Planets rotate at different speeds and different angles. Try to guess each planet's angle of rotation by matching it to the angle of the beach ball. To All change right. the tilt of the ball, click on the boot. To make the ball spin, just click on it. Then try to make a match by clicking on a planet. Okay, so we click on ball starts spinning, click on Jupiter, looks the same, click on that, Mars got the same, Saturn probably has this, nope, Saturn is not the same, neither is Neptune, neither is Earth, well again, slightly more, nope, not Mercury, Pluto, yeah, Earth's axis isn't like that, is it? Okay, so we kick it again. That'd be Uranus's. Kick it again. Oh, let's go back up now. Uh, Saturn, would be Neptune, not Venus, not Mercury, not Earth. So Saturn, yeah, Saturn has the same rotation like this. Neptune would have the same rotation like, no? Earth? Uh, Venus. Mercury. Uh, okay, so it's one kick per planet. Because I know Earth is like that. Because uh, if I click on that too. Okay, so I gotta do one at a time. So I gotta click this back up to here for Neptune. And Mercury goes straight up and down. Get it! We are the masters of space. Oh, fade into existence. Anyway, we're done here. Let's just move on to the jumping game for Uranus. Again. What was the music for this one? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. This one's fantastic. Alright, going straight up with this one. Grab those boots first. Oh, arrow keys just quit out there for a sec. And jump! There we go. So the stars really don't do very much, do they? And jump! Aha, I got the jetpack, which means I can just mosey my way over onto the coin. Hooray! Alright, that orb is gone. And we just go into the bus and we can move on to our next planet. 
Second last one. Off to Neptune. Off to Neptune. Here we go. Go with my headphones. Whoa. That sure makes a cool sound when it rotates. Wizzle wobble, wibble wobble. Very cool. All right, we are here. We're also gonna have a lot of coins so we can guess at a lot of locations, which will be very helpful to us. In case, you know, I get it wrong, which I don't think I'm gonna get it wrong. Pretty, I think I know what I got. what's going on here. All right, what's this sketch notepad have to show us? Have we done this one before? I don't think we have. Nope. This is the planet cut and slice science experiment. Ooh. Cut the planets in half to see what scientists think is in the middle of each one. Ah. Click on a planet, then snip, 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 snip. Cut. snip. Got it. Cool. So Earth, we cut her in half. We all know what that looks like on the inside. Mars looks very similar to what Earth looks like, with a uh, thicker crust. Um. Uh, Maybe a smaller core. What's Venus look like? All right, so it's got a bit, a bit, a bit of a bigger mantle. Uh, kind of a small core. Mercury. That's cute how Mercury didn't fit, so. Mercury's got a very big core. Jupiter. Can those scissors even cut that planet? Ha whoosh! Oh. That's interesting. Very interesting. Saturn. So these are the big old. Uh, okay, so it's gonna be similar to Jupiter's. Uranus. Ah, very cool. Neptune. Gonna be similar to Uranus's. And poor little Pluto. Very cold planet. Oh, cool. Ice. Ice. Oh, out of the way, scissors. Okay, that's that. Very cool. All right, now that we're done with that, let's move on to the Neptune jumping game. Are we just going to be starting in the air? Okay, what do we do? Help, 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 falling. Falling. Okay. Oh, falling. Falling. Jetpack. Perfect. All right. Oh, I get what's going on. Oh. Oh, I get what's going on. I gotta fall all the way to the bottom. Grab that jetpack. That one. And then I have to work my way back up. I have no jump. Grab the boots. That. Jump up. Grab this balloon. Jump up. We're gonna go for this balloon over here. Oh, we are gonna run out of oxygen. Hopefully, there's a tank up here somewhere. Yeah, there's some oxygen. Jump up. Yeah. Use that balloon. Up, 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 up. Ah, ah, going for it, just going for it. Grab that oxygen. Up and jump. Up, stay easy. We got this, we got this. Going for the coin, going for the coin. Ooh, that one was tricky. I did not expect that one. I guess it's just gas planet, you know, you're just gonna fall. All right, that was fun. Back in the bus for our last planet, Pluto, which We've already been to, technically we could skip that one, but, you know, we can't forget about our, our favorite little planet. I mean, dwarf planet. I mean, hunk of rock, the edge of space. Can't forget about him. So let's go. This 
this is the first one we went to. I think. When we started playing this. I don't remember. You guys remember? I don't remember. Look at all those coins we got up there. We would have had one more if we did that in the new game, but eh, it's done it already. No big deal. We're gonna do this last science. Oh, this is the one with the uh, the rocket tilt and shoot, isn't it? So, yeah, let's jump into it. Why not? Why not? This is the Pluto. Yes, loop. we got it. Science. Okay, so let's see if we can get the right orbit. <laughs> Fire! I got the right orbit! Okay, so... If I tilt it slightly up... Oh, it's perfect! It's a perfect orbit! It's beautiful! Yay! It's a perfect orbit! Wonderful! Alright, close that. We're done with that. Into Pluto. For our last little jumping meet again. Ah, oh, yes. With Anus. Yes, the gravity's a little bit weaker here, so that's fun. Whee! And. Up! Right, that's where we gotta get going. Oh right, this is the slippery planet. We gotta get the spring boots. So we can jump higher. Higher than we've ever jumped before. Activate spring boots! I've made it! Woohoo! Ah! Dang it, we gotta be on that platform. And then we just gotta jump straight on up. This is gonna be hard to judge. Oh, dang it. I have no idea where that platform's gonna be. Perfect. And now we just wait for this one. And jump! Made it! Very good, Arnold. Very good job. I had 1337 uh, points there for that one. I had leet points. Literally leet points. Or is that 37331? I don't remember. Anyway, that's the last minigame. We now have four coins for four guesses. But I'm pretty sure our frizz is going to be on uh, this planet. So quick jump. Figuring out little things here. Push the button. Good guess. But I'm somewhere else. That's not it. This planet's rings are a dark gray color. So dark gray color. One of the strangest moons in the whole solar system, Miranda, is here. It looks like somebody Miranda. blew it apart and put it back. This planet looks a lot more like its neighbor than it used to. Because its neighbor used to have a spot. And the neighbor used to have a spot. This is the planet that used to have a spot. Unless it still does. Alright, let's quick jump to Jupiter. Throw in another coin. See if that's it. Oh, Frizzle! Nice try, but I'm not here. All right, we gotta do our math. We gotta do our research. Let's just take a quick look at Neptune. Cause I only got three coins left. So this one, does it have a moon named Miranda? Neptune at a glance, no. Wanna go to Neptune, no. Got rings, got eight moons. Does not tell me about Neptune. Neptune by Janet. Janet, who's Janet? Neptune. The great dark spot is a hurricane that circles Neptune. The spot is as big as our whole Earth. In 1994, it disappeared. But oh, yawn. Like storms usually do. Okay. I wish I'd been on Voyager 2. It That's cool. And everything. But I want to know how many moons. What the name of the moons are. Whoa, there goes Pluto. 
Okay, okay, that's enough of that. So there are a little, couple of little things to click on, but this, I don't think this is the right planet. Uranus at a glance. It's got rings. Ah, Miranda. So it's, it is Uranus that we got to go to. Or your <laughs> Quick warp. Throw the coin in. Throw the coin in. So we get two extra coins. And guess. Victory. Oh, there's a dark ring right there. Okay, we figured it out. We got it. Hooray! Hooray! Aw, it's kind of sad. This is our last episode. That's it. That's it. There's nothing left in this. We've, we've looked at everything. I mean, we haven't looked at all the report parts. We haven't clicked on any of the kids. There's no kids to click on in here. Well, that's fun. All right, that's... That's it. That's it, class. I think we've, uh... We've pretty much exhausted this game. I mean, we could look at the rest of the reports and, you know, muck about for a little longer, but, you know, that's the meat of this game. Magic School Bus explores the solar system. Would I play it and remake it? Absolutely. There's so much to learn in this game, and I hope you guys learned a thing or two about this whole series. And about space! What's out there? And the great beyond. So, stay tuned till, for uh, till next time when we throw in another Magic School Bus game, maybe. Maybe uh, we're done with this, so, you know, I can stop holding that, but... You know, we've got other Magic School Bus games to play and explore. So stay tuned for those. Like, comment, subscribe. All that fun stuff that, you know, you normal viewers like to do. And I hope this was a great nostalgic trip for you guys as well. So stay tuned for the next upcoming content. See other content that I've made on this channel because there's lots to see. And I think that's all I get to say. So, till next time, class is dismissed. <laughs>